everybody. How are you? Maybe I'll put this over there. It's Terrific Tuesday. I love when I jump on and I can see this right away. It's whether or not I can get to the comments. So if you jump on, say hey so I know you're there. I think I told everybody I was going at this time, right? Let's hope. We will give it a couple of minutes. Hey, when you jump on. Oh, didn't want to do that. I need to pin it. It won't let me pin stuff to the top anymore. Okay, I'm gonna finish drying this while we wait. Hope everybody had a good weekend. Hey Deb, how are you? How you been? I literally kind of just put this design together that we're going to be working on tonight. <laughs> I wasn't sure what time I'd be able to come on, if I was going to be able to come on. I'm doing good. Hi Debbie, how are you? Lots of Debbies. You know what happens when there's a lot of Debbies watching. Sure enough, some Debbie's gonna win something tonight, right? I am doing well. I am doing well. Love the spool. Oh, okay. I love I love spools too. You know, I could kick myself just like I'm sure many of you. How many have thrown away? you know, your grandmother's wooden spools that I have my grandmother's sewing basket. It's more like a picnic basket. Um, but back in the day, I just thought they were little dirty pieces of wood. There was like hundreds of bobbins in that basket. And believe it or not, I still have thread that she used. Um, that was like seven cents. A sp like it still has funny price tags on it in dust, a lot of dust. <laughs> so I really don't use anything in there. I just, I just have it. I just know it's there. But yeah, like I've tossed so many spools away. Now I can, I do have some thread ones that I use on designs. I'm down to not many of those left. So I use those sparingly. But yeah, thank you for the share. Thank you for sharing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, hey Laura, how are ya? You do too? Oh, I love, you know, whenever I come across, I threw a lot of stuff away because I, I guess I just didn't realize how important it would be to me later on in life. And we moved a lot. Um, you know, we were constantly moving, my husband and I and my family. And some of it just seemed like, why do I keep bringing this with me? But I used to have two of our sewing machines. Ugh. How are you? Hey, Ginny, how are ya? All right, we're gonna stop. If you are watching for the first time, if that little box up there says live, obviously you're watching live. If not, you're watching the replay. Please put hashtag new if you're new. I would love to welcome you. I am Patty Colbert. I'm an independent designer with Chalk Couture, and you all know I love what I do. I just love doing this. Um, thank you, Ginny. I uh, actually spoke with a couple of potential designers today, um, and I think they're gonna love what they do too. So, is that great? So, wasn't on, was I? No, was not on live yesterday, and that's usually when we do a little housekeeping. So let's do some housekeeping. If you are in my pillar stand club and you are doing April's project with us, 
please um, head on, first of all, head on over to our group page and you will see the transfer that was selected by you all. Um, and then please purchase the transfer by tomorrow. Um, I did list the color paste that I'm going to be using, but of course you never have to use the same colors I do. Just know all those free embellishments I send probably will have something to do with the colors I use, but you can use any color you want. But please, please um, order no later tomorrow. That way I know how many embellishments and embellishment packages I need to make and have them mailed in time to you so we can all do the project on the 21st. Hey, Marilyn, how are you? Thank you, Deb. Um, welcome to Tuesday night. So if you are gonna do April's project with us, please order that transfer by tomorrow, okay? Um, guys, this is unbelievable. I got a huge box yesterday from Chalk Central, and I got three orders in one. Hey, Angie, three orders. And guess what? If you are doing the Mother's Day kit with us, I have everything already. Ah, how unbelievable is that? I've got your door tag. I'm looking at it all, it's piled. I have your door tags, I have your mini tags, I have your, I have everything. I have your six pack of paste that we're using. Let me show you how they came. So it's the first time I ordered the new Creamy Dreamy. So your paste packet, this six creamy, dreamy, dreamy, creamy paste packets in here for you, six of them. Um, it's going to take me that long just to cut the ribbon. What else is in there? Um, this, the tag, the tag. Yeah. And all the ribbon. So I, all I have to do is cut the ribbon and put everything together. I'm so excited. How awesome. So we can go ahead and make this earlier. Um, and you can decide if you want to make more because of course, you have the transfer or you can just use the transfer and make other designs with it. So I am super excited they came in that early. Marilyn, I love you. But, oh my God, guys, I'm so excited for you to use this paste. All right, so that's the Mother's Day kit. Um, again, if you didn't order the kit and want to follow along, um, just ask me, I can let you know. We're using the um, Smart Loving Kind transfer and a dog tag. And then of course there's a lot of little things. But um, if you wanna follow along, the um, ingredients, the products are still available on the website. And you can go ahead and order those separate if you want. Um, hi Linda, thanks for watching. All right, so that's the pillar stand. That's our Mother's Day kit. Okay. Guess what else came? This is, um, a I'm lost for words. This is April's Club Couture. I... Every, every month I'm loving and loving and loving even more than the previous month. Okay guys, if you are in Club Couture, you will receive this transfer this month and Chalk Central is sending you, <laughs> look what they're sending you all free. You are a dream come true. And you are getting some fresh, new, brand new, creamy, dreamy paste. Free. This will be in your subscription envelope this month. All my club subscribers are going to get this. So if you are still on the fence about the club every so often, uh, Chalk Couture does something. You know, you get your specials and deals for $19.99 per month. You get your transfer. It's exclusive to you and designers. We're the only ones who get this transfer. You cannot buy it. Um, you get three coordinating paste packets. 
uh, free shipping on the monthly subscription. But then going forward, you get uh, $4.95 shipping on all your orders all the time, no matter what the cost is. And they're always doing some steals and deals for our club members. Um, so if you're thinking about doing it, I would definitely join as some of my customers here. Um, it is a minimum of three months. They would like you to stay in it three months. And if at that point you feel like it's just something you don't want to do anymore, you're more than welcome to cancel your subscription. But it's really good. You, you get all the feels when your transfer comes in every month. It's a lot of fun. Um, and then also you get a PDF, a how-to PDF in a link to a how-to video. And uh, Chalk Central is doing two different ways or showing you two different ways to use that transfer each month. So endless possibilities. You guys would love it. I keep saying try it, try it, try it, try it. It's great just for the benefits alone. I promise you it is. If you have, oh, Linda is your friend. Well, welcome, Deb's friend, Linda. I see that small transfer in Matcha's Club. Matcha's Club. Well, I think it, it depended on whether when you placed your last order and stuff. So that's why. Designers may have gotten it later, too. They were doing it in shifts. Oh, are you still like in trouble, Kelsey? <laughs> All right, so that's the Pillar Stand Club. That's our Club Couture, guys. Try it, try it, try it. If you want more information on either one of those, I know it seems like a lot. Hashtag Pillar Stand Club. That's a lot of fun. It's optional. You can do it one month and not do it for three more months. Totally up to you. Or hashtag Club Couture, and I will send you more information on both those clubs, okay? It's a lot of fun. Both of them are a lot of fun, okay? So, what are we gonna do today? Guys, I really just kind of like put this all together and one of the projects we're gonna do, so you all know that I lost three things, or, or I didn't lose them, when we moved into this rental. Um, so we found one. I forgot what the first one was. But remind me, I, for, we lost, I forgot what it was, but we found it. The second one I still haven't found, and that was the um, transfer that I lost, the Pillar Club, Pillar Stand Club transfer. I had to order a new one. And then the Mason cutouts, okay? And when we were still in the, my other house, um, prior to selling it, I had done a lot of whitewashing with y'all one night. I think I just spent an hour whitewashing and talking. Napkins transfer and something else. Oh, the joys of moving. Yes. Yeah. Oh, the napkins. You're right. You are right. It was napkins. You are right. Okay. Well, here's the third thing that I found. So I did a bunch of whitewashing. I think it was around before Christmas because I remember whitewashing some trees and some of the cardboard things that we were using like as gift boxes. And I whitewashed these wooden cutout mason jaws. And I could not find them. And Jeff was so kind to pack me up that he kept push, putting, he puts things in things. And he thinks that that's the best way to move things. Um, and it wasn't, although that's he's, <laughs> although he is very organized. He is the best packer and mover when you have to move with your family. But he doesn't care what bin things go in, where I am very organized, okay? I found them. I found them. Hey, Terry, thank you. I found them. Um, they were in something that they shouldn't have been in. 
and I moved that something to get under something else and I heard a little and I went, I bet you those are the mason jaws. Sure enough, here they are. So yeah, you're right, it was the napkins. I can't remember which napkins. It was the napkins, it was the transfer, and this. All right, so we're gonna use the mason jaw, okay? So I, all right, so these just, these are just, I think they're one eighth, they were um, cut out wood mason jaws, okay? I whitewashed both sides back in November, I think, and then just did kind of like a little paint glaze on top. And I don't even remember, I probably used black and gray, okay? And then, um, what I did was I took, you know what, I can actually show you with this one. Let me do this. Just in case you all want to do it. Push all this aside. All right. So, this is what it looks like. And it was distressed looking, which is what we were going for, right? All right, so I wanted to put like a little bit of white, like a little whitewash on it just to brighten it up. And the easiest way to do that, or for me, the easiest way to do that, and this is just apple barrel. This is just, can't open the paint. All right, so just a little bit of paint because I don't have much to do, right? And then I, uh, it, it's so much easier for me when I just sprinkle a little bit of water on it. Honestly, just that much, okay? And then you can water this down a little if you want. And then what I do is I just put it on here. So it's just like a light coat. And honestly, that's all you do. You can not water this down and make it lighter if you want. You can use other colors if you want, but that's all you have to do. Okay, so this one is almost like that one now. Okay. That's it. All right. And again, you can do that any color. All right, so I was thinking, let's go ahead and make this, and we're gonna, I'm gonna stop putting away all my Easter things, guys. Um, they are all for sale. So if you want something, let me know. Um, but we are gonna do the Watts of Love fundraiser soon, I hope, pretty soon, okay? So I went ahead and I did this earlier so it would dry. Yeah, we actually, we had people move us, but Jeff wanted to, but we, um, we used to have so many company moves. It's funny because I, I really used to just sit back with the three littles and they would do everything for us. Then they would unpack us. So I really didn't have a lot to do. The last couple of moves we've done on our own when the new house is finished, we're gonna have to move from here. Um, so the big stuff, you know, we definitely get people to move us, but the little stuff we kind of like to do, like, you know, actually bring it into the house, put it away before a lot more stuff starts coming in. So we have it, we know what we're doing when it comes to moves, believe me. All right, so the reason why I took this project today is because Mother's Day's coming. Like I said, we have um, the Mother's Day kit if you are partaking in that. Um, I know some of you have some transfers from last year, even the year before, because you've been around that long. Thank you, thank you. 
Um, so I was thinking you would probably, if you wanted to do this, um, and we used to have a mason jaw transfer. Um, some of you have that one. Um, but I'm not using this transfer, but I took it out because I do have two of these. These were from 2019. I got it from my mama. So I do have two of these left. And they are $9.99 plus shipping. Again, I only have two. So if you want one, put hashtag from my mama. The first two that post that in, um, if you want it, I will send a PayPal invoice out, okay? But something like this would look really cute on it too. So I have that one. And then I have another, um, oh my God, my mother was right about everything. I have that transfer we're probably gonna use. Um, oh, good, Deb. That's a cute one. It really is. I put it on a um, onesie. You're not supposed to say that word. But I did put it on a onesie uh, with ink. It was really cute. All right. Let me tell you what we're going to do. I was thinking, how are we going to make that look prettier? So the first thing I found in my finds was this chalkboard. I don't know how long I've had it. I don't know where I got it from. Oh, hobby and crap. I can find it for you. Oh, Michaels, it's from Michaels. But you know, we have chalkboards. You don't need to search that one. Let me go ahead and click this. But I did like the size of it, so I decided to use it. And then I thought, let's make it pretty and um, like floral almost. So I am gonna use this transfer that I uh, haven't used. This is from last year. It might still even be, it's called the Fall Floral Frame. I actually know some of you have this because some of you showed me designs in it. And it was kind of like perfect for what I wanted it for because I just want it on the outside. You're not supposed to say that. Yeah, are you asking me that question or? No, it's not offensive, it's a uh, trademark. So like if you go to sell something, if I go to sell a, you have to call them jumpers. If I are a one piece item, if I go to, if I make one and sell it, I can't list it as a onesie. Yep, yeah. I know that's kind of crazy. You can't keep up, right? That's why if you like go on Etsy or, you know, anybody who does, um, who makes things, you won't see that word. They call it something else. Yep. All right, why I picked this is because I just kind of wanted floral to border it. I have so many floral patterns, you all know that. I actually, I know I've only put one out there, but I really am gonna start reselling my used transfers. That, that too, all those proceeds go to lots of love. I just gotta open the book and do it. So we're gonna start doing that again. Soda Fountain, I think is still for sale if anybody wanted that one. It is foolish, it is. I mean, they can like shut you down for saying or writing that word. Right, but I can say it because like you can say, like a lot of people do chocature baby showers and everybody does, designs a onesie. So you kind of have to say the word, right? Wait, I don't know, that'll be okay. I'm testing it to make sure it's not gonna stick too much. Because if it was, I would have to. Put. So I'm gonna do it this way so I can see. If this was, if I felt like It was too sticky, I would put wax on it. I 
think I want more on the bottom because I'm gonna put a little bit of I want to get more of this on the bottom because I am going to put ribbon on the top and we're going to do it hot mess. This is a little bit wider than the jaw, but I'm okay with that too. I think I'll be all right. Let's see. All right, we are going to use Lots of, we're gonna use all the colors. Onesies. All right, I should that. You know it's gonna bother me. It's just a little off, boys and girls. Off on the side, and that would really bother me. Much better. So I know a lot of you use this for um, like the monograms and you added some other designs in it. I, I guess I never used it. All right, so we're going to use, I've got white. Guys, I've got all the creamy dreamy now. So now I kind of want to just throw away all my other stuff. Oh, here's. Golden Hour. Okay, Golden Hour. This is for this. I was like, that's a little much, Patty. Oh, that's for that too. No. Nope. That's for the middle. Okay, put that aside. We've got peony. And we have, oh, this is the, I keep forgetting. It's like that, you know what? That doesn't look so good, guys. Let's see, this might be the last time I use this one. I love that yellow. It's so pretty. And it is a shade off of daffodil. If any of you still have daffodil, it is super pretty. Let me bring it up there. And it's creamy dreamy. And I believe this, let me tell you. Yep. Some of you are getting the new I don't know if you can see it because of the light. Um, some of you, if you bought the Mother's Day kit, you're going to get some yellow in the Mother's Day kit. All right, and then this one is Colonial Blue. Oh, same for this one. We may be throwing this away. I don't need to throw this away, but because I have all the new paste, I almost were like, I don't want to use this one anymore. All right. We're going to do hot mess. So I'm just kind of, kind of like plop it down a little bit. Get more of these. 
maybe I'll just give them to you. And if it works, it works. And if I would never sell it, but maybe I will just put them in the package with you. That's a great idea. I would never charge you for them. Okay. That is an excellent idea, Angie. All right, let's go ahead and plop away. Now, remember, I don't have to do anything in the middle, right? I'm just trying to, and no rhyme or reason. I always say that. What does that even mean, guys? We're just gonna plop away. If I'm not doing it equally and it bothers you, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not matchy-matchy. You all know that about me by now. Definitely want to get some pink in there. Now, you can use a squeegee to stir all this up. Or you can use your fingers. Let's get this blue down. This is such a... It's on its way out but it really is a beautiful blue. Okay, so you can use your finger, you can use a squeegee. I don't know why I took so many out. But the one thing you don't wanna do is put it all back in a container because it's contaminated. It's got more than the one color in it, right? Looks like finger painting, guys. Now, I'm not doing um, ombre. Ombre is when you um, merge two colors together. And this really is just kind of being sloppy with it. <laughs> I don't know how else to say it. But after you do it, right, you want to squeegee up the excess like you would with any project that you're working on. But you don't want to put it back in the jaw, like I said. Now, if this was all creamy, dreamy paste, you wouldn't even have to hurry. Um, it doesn't dry as fast, so you have more time to work with it. border I mean it's really pretty too I know a lot of people use that for um, they used some of the like the uh, trilogy words we had and of course monograms a lot of people used it for monograms so that yellow really shows up let me I'll bring this up and show you drop it. Now you could go ahead now, Kelsey, and throw some glitter down. I'm not using the glitter tonight, although I am using some silver on it. So glitter actually would be pretty on it. Well, I'm not gonna, but you can sprinkle just a little bit of glitter on it. All right, I'm going to put the paste aside that I know I'm not going to use anymore. And maybe these will be giveaways tonight, guys. Thanks, Linda. All right, so we said the purple and the blue I'm definitely done with, right? 
maybe we'll give those two away tonight. Because you're right, we shouldn't throw them away. Although I have thrown some away, guys. But not the new stuff. Right. Make sure you get in the habit of cleaning the lids with the new ones, okay? I'm still so bad about that. Um, with the older paste, I'm still gonna add a little bit of water before I close it up. That blue is pretty. It is pretty. We have some light blues that were so light that I don't use a lot of them and I should. That, that and Lakeshaw. Lakeshaw was really pretty. Ocean mist. Right. We'll keep those there. All right. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do to the mason jar, and we'll let this dry before we hit it with a dryer. So here's the mason jaw, here's the side, the white side. If you guys want to do this project later, let me know and I can get you the link. I definitely remember where I bought them from, even though I bought them over a year ago. All right, so I have taken out my metal ribbon and at first I was gonna do some chicken wire and I still may, but I'm going to use the thicker one, the prettier one, first I want to get my toys out. First I want to go ahead and put the transfer down. Now, normally I would wax this, but if you look, guys, this transfer is so old, three years, three plus years old, and I have used it so many times that I know I don't have to worry about it sticking. So if this was a brand new transfer I was using tonight, I would definitely have to fuzz it and wax this first because I put paint down and you wouldn't want to pull the paint up. So this little transfer says, Mama's Kitchen. And the font is so pretty. The new blue is, um, well, there was a shimmer, remember? And let me get the new, new one. So it was Shimmer Splash. It was Shimmer, Shimmer Splash is the new blue. I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna put this down. Probably right in the middle. I'm going to use this, but maybe I will. I'm putting a ribbon up there. Hmm. We will see. All right, let's do this for now. So I have lines on, not lines, but this is a wood tabletop. And whoever made it, it's like off, it's like slanted so every time I think I have something lined up 
that line is drives me nuts because it's not like I wish it was like just smooth with like one piece of wood like a big butcher block that's gonna be okay I think that'll be okay all right so I wanted to darken this up a little bit so I'm using current jam it's my jam shimmer the shimmer you couldn't is it out of stock I didn't think there were any out of stock I thought you already bought it no oh no cuz you didn't get anybody who bought it got the blueberry um, if you bought it you I sent you a blueberry bucket to make shimmer splash With my face transfer to uh, it's not coming up the whole question oh wait about to use it and it's definitely not sticking it so if it's not sticky first of all wash it okay wash it make sure you dry it sticky side up and Terry's absolutely right um, you can always use a spray adhesive not on the transfer on the surface that you're using Yeah, so if you had bought a um, that color, I was giving out those berry baskets. Some of you probably have already gotten them. All right, current jam. Just to darken it up a little. Oh my God, this is, guys, hold on. These squeegees you can't get anymore. They were our small ones, but they were horizontal and not vertical. And I keep, every time I grab this, I keep thinking it's the other way. I need to separate those. I, those actually are my favorite. So see, this goes vertical. Um, those actually are my favorite, but they don't make them anymore. All right. And then we're just gonna squeegee up the excess. So yeah, Kelsey, go ahead and wash the transfer again. Sometimes you just need to rewash it. It could be because maybe you put it on the back or when it was still wet. And even if you dry it with a fuzzing cloth, sometimes that does bring back this brings the sticky back. So try that. Get that font, Terry. Yeah, so I use, you know, they have, um, Mod Podge has some. This is Treehouse. I got it at Hobby Lobby, spray adhesive. And then I use, somewhere in here there's well, it might be on my other desk. Um, on the other side, I use, um, it's called stencil adhesive. I get that one at, a, on Amazon. So you can get any kind. It doesn't matter which one you get. But, you know, I do like, I do have favorites, so. But it's good to have. All right, let's go ahead and dry this. Yeah, go ahead and try it. You should be fine. I've always said this. I love current jam. I use it all year long. I use it all year long. I really do.
so this all right so we've used the metal ribbon before right I don't use it that often so I just went ahead and cut a piece and I'm kind of using it for the lid I'm hoping I can nail it and if not I'll have to um, watched me last time do this. I keep forgetting this isn't as deep as my other one. Hold on. Never had these issues in the other house, guys. And you can hot glue this if you end up doing this. Oh, it was easy to get it off the table. Or just put smaller. I do have smaller pins. You would think I would change them out every so often, but I don't. Current jam's a beautiful. You have the same ribbon. Oh, yeah. It's funny. I don't use it as much as I really... Th I know I bought it for a project and thought I would use it all the time. And I really don't. I wish I did. Because it is pretty on things. Go ahead and finish this up. Okay. So we're definitely going to put ribbon and we're going to put roses, but we're going to put this down first. I need to know where it's going to go. Did I just do that? Alright. So let's go ahead and put this on so we know exactly where it's going. So here's, let me show you the ribbon close. Oh, cross. That would be pretty. You're right. That would be pretty. So I was like, what am I gluing? Right. 
Be careful. Save that. Oh, Deb. I honestly didn't know I was doing this until I found the jaw. <laughs> I found it and I was like, okay, now what can I do with it? I forgot why I wanted it last time, what I was using it for. Something tells me I might have bought it for the sugar cookie um, transfer, one of those. I can't really remember, but probably something like that. All right, let's poke it out. So remember, we already have two holes up here that the, um, the jute was on. So I'm gonna use, I'm, I'm gonna cover one and then I'm gonna put flowers on one side. So and I'm purposely only doing this. I'm not doing like a lot of leaves and stuff because I put this design on this background for show. So I don't wanna then cover it all up. But I think I wanted to do that. And then I was gonna do the ribbon on that side. And that's what I was gonna do. All right, so let's finish this. So let's go ahead and, God, I have so much stuff over here. That's for the other project. This is for the other project. So, I might actually put, yeah. I might do this on here. Only because it's so pretty. It's way too pretty not to. All right, let's go ahead and get some jute in here. Uh, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Yeah, I want jute. I want jute. And then I'm gonna put it in the hole that was already here. If you guys find something like this, you know, you can actually use our um, board and base frames. You don't have to use the wood pot um, if you ever wanted to stick something to it. some yellow. Yellow would be really pretty on here too. Let's do this. This was for the next one, but let's go ahead and use some of this too. Let's get some gray to kind of throw in that metallic. I know, I probably already have one of these opened. Uh, 
Ugh. Everybody has metal ribbon. I do have yellow. I need to, I feel like I need to get some yellow. Hold on. Yellow lay, oh, you know what? Oh, hold on. Hold on. I, <laughs> hold on. When in doubt, I have yellow. I knew I had yellow. This is just frayed, frayed. Jeff, where are you watching TV? Because it's very loud. Jeff? Jeff? Yeah. Do you know I'm doing a live? Sorry, I'll go outside. You'll go outside? <laughs> All right. Let's play. All right. Let's bring some. I might actually cut another piece of that. Get some white. Get some gray. I'm gonna I think I'm gonna put a little this guy in too. Just because we can. Don't I always say that? Just because we can. this. So I had cut this up, but now I'm thinking it's too um, juvenile looking, right? So we won't use it. So let's just go ahead and tie this down and then we'll make it look pretty after I put the roses down. Yeah, I use those and then, like, I usually buy, um, like, I'll buy my lace like this and then I re-roll them on the wood. Sometimes it's just easier for me to work like that. All right, so I'm not going to take this, I'm not going to cut all this up yet until I figure out where I want the roses. The war of the roses where are we gonna put it I kind of like whatever I did before <laughs> but safety first I kind of like it right there so let's see if I can Get this on. God, do you guys see that steam coming out of here? Hi, Anne. How are ya? I am doing better. Thank you. We use protection, right, ladies? <laughs> my PSA. If you don't want to put your safety fingers on, get a popsicle stick. Actually, these, us, our multi-tools work really well too. I'm just, I'm trying to, oh, I think I bent it the right way. <laughs> All 
All right. Let's just kind of trim this up a little. And this will look really cute in one of our um, like board and base stands or something like that. So let's just kind of Oh, I like that little, just that little pop that we threw in there of that current jam. <sighs> Guys, I think this came out super cute. Now you could, so remember this came with a jute. You could definitely have kept that in if you want to like hang it. But I'll get, I'll get a um, stand, hold on. To show you, I'm just gonna hang it like that. I have so many chocolate ones back there. I just need to get it out. Do you like it? Debbie, how are ya? I'm wondering if, did you get, you probably haven't gotten the transfer yet. Debbie is the first one to do the train transfer. So I'm super excited about, I cannot wait to see what you guys do. I'm so excited that we're doing that again. All right, so guys, we have, um, there's so many. We actually have new transfers that have all those kitchen sayings that you could use. Um, somebody already claimed one of these. Deb, I think. It would make a great Mother's Day gift. So I only have two of, I got it from my mama. Um, somebody claimed one. Maybe somebody claimed the second one. I don't know. But they're $9.99 plus shipping, which is $1.20, I think. Um, so if you want it, hashtag, I got it from my mama and the first two that, I only have two. So the first two that wanted it is going to get it. Okay. And, um, I'm going to say that that's a big one. We'll do that one. I'm glad we threw the yellow in. Let me bring that. Can you guys see it? Super cute, right? You want it. <laughs> well, all my stuff is for sale because all the proceeds go to Watts of Love. I don't know how I just did that. So it will be on the website. But you can make it too. So all our new trans, like we have all those farmhouse, all those new transfers, right? That would be super cute. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad you thought of that, Terry. Yeah, so this was our, it was called, it's called our fall floral frame. And it was because you could put anything in the middle of it. Like your, we, our monograms, one of our sayings, uh, pumpkins, you could put pumpkins in it. So there was a lot of things you could do with it. Right, Terry, right. All right, and I think Angie has a point. If anybody, um, this glue all over the place. If um, I think instead of, I was gonna throw away all these old paste. Not that there's anything wrong with them, it's just I don't wanna deal with them. Um, because if you saw my cabinet, guys. So I think if, if, you, if anybody buys the um, used transfers, then I think I'll start throwing the paste in with it. 
because I don't want them and I don't want to sell them, but I, I will give them away. So we'll do that. There's only one transfer I have up for sale in the VIP lounge. I've only gotten to one. I promise I'll be better. I need to, I need to move these old transfers and you know guys, I only use them once. So they really, they really are like brand new. Yes, it, this one, I think this one was maybe three years ago. But we have, if you look through the catalog, like all the, um, the our Farm Charm collection. Like you can take, um, we have so many transfers with the word mother or mom on it. I, I mean, I have, I actually have many. Um, like you can do, you can put mama's kitchen, like you can use any of these. Mama's local market. Like there's so many, you can like intertwine so many of these transfers. Um, but you know what, I'll look through and see what we have. Let me look at. Yeah, this one wouldn't work unless you know what would be cute. So this is the transfer that's going in the kit for, the, for those of you who bought the kit from me, um, or you can just go on my website and buy it. This would be really cute as like a subway tile, like like just all the words on it too. That would be really, you know I love doing that. I, I don't have any back here, but I love putting the transfers over something. So that would be really cute too. You would have all these words on something like that. I think that would look adorable actually. And then you can zhuzh it up. But this transfer, so the reason why I did my kits early is because you know anything with mother on it, is going to go out of stock or should well i shouldn't say should but there's a high probability and people right now are not thinking mother's day but starting after easter they will so if this is a transfer that you want you can get it on my website it's called smart loving kind and the number is b21111115 how many ones is that one two three four five ones and a five b2 one 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 five if you want the link let me know i'll send you the link um but that would be really cute too guys paddles but i can't think of the name where did you buy the chalkboard oh um are you talking about these Oh, you're talking about the cutting boards. All right, so these are these are chalk couture cutting boards. We have these now. Is that what you're talking about? And these, I sent the link out before. These had the actual chalkboard on it. Um, Amazon. They, whenever I did this, we put the link out. But if you need it, let me know. I can find it again. But these are chalk couture, and you can paste right on them. You don't have to do anything, if that's what you mean. Every mama needs one. I think they are Oh, are you talking about these? The paddles? The um, wooden spoons? What is a pie? So I know a pie, what is it called? A pie? I have one. The pie one that you put, it's called a, not a pie flipper, it's called a pie palette. It's called a pie something. All right, good. Right, I, so I'm going to clean up, I'm going to have dinner, and then I'll go through the comments tonight. Um, i got to sit around for two and a half hours <laughs> doing frogs. Um, so I'll get the link again. No, spatula! Ding, 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 ding. 
Sherry, I need to send you a spatula. <laughs> no, but the pot, it's called, hold, don't anybody go anywhere. Hold on. Obviously, it's not the, the spatula. This is called a pizza paddle. We're going to play around with this. I have no idea. Oh, guys. Oh, my God. You know what would be super cute? This transfer on a pizza paddle. Look. You could paint it, you can border it with flowers, even a bigger trend. So I had to look for a small transfer to do this, but you know, Doreen and her flowers, you could do the background all in flowers and then put this on front and some ribbon. Maybe we'll play with this. Maybe we'll do that. <laughs> that is a big spanker. Yeah, this is cute on a kitchen counter. You know, in Texas, our ceilings are high so things like this are really pretty or you can just leave it on a table too but this would be super cute you can actually put a sawtooth on it too and hang it endless possibilities or you can get a small one whichever <laughs> whatever all right oh uh, only you kelsey would think of that all right, guys, I actually have another project, but it would put us way over the two-hour mark. This one came out cute. I like this. And Angie, thanks for the idea. I promise you, I think I threw away six paces today. Picking colors just because I didn't want to deal because I don't have to deal anymore. But I think I will stop giving those away. So long as you guys know that they're not, you know, creamy dreamy. Right? All right. You do love a good floral pattern. All right, guys. Love to all. Thanks for joining. Remember, guys, Pillar Stand Club. Order that transfer by tomorrow. Okay? Um, Club Couture. Oh, my God. Who doesn't want to play with that one this month? I do. It's here. I just can't. I'm afraid anything I pick up right now, other things are going to go over. What if you could, what if I fail? What if you fly? You know, this is, this is big. Um, I will put the link to anything that you want. Just hashtag whatever you want and I will get you the link. Um, for those of you who bought Mother's Day kits, I'll probably send those out this week sometime, probably at the end of the week. Yay! Um, I'm so glad we ordered those early. And think about it, you can do a lot with this but even if you wanted to do the little mason jaw actually they have bigger mason jaws too so if anybody wanted the link to the mason jaw um the link i'm going to give you that you pick the size you want so you could do a bigger one and put this on it and then put it on a bigger chalkboard guys think about it ruby slippers <gasps> Ah, uh, Doreen for this one. You know we had ruby slippers? Wait a minute. I think you know we had ruby slippers, right? You're not going to put funny monkeys with it, are you? Doreen, you're giving away all your secrets. Yeah, we used to have um, the rubies. We used to have the shoes. We did. All right. Love to all. Thank you for watching. I will get to your comments tonight. If you need anything from me, just let me know. Okay. Bye everyone.